Hey, what's up everyone? This is Todd Hazleton with Techno Buffalo. We're checking out the LG G2. It's just announced today and it's going to land on AT&T, Verizon, Sprint, and T-Mobile in the United States, although pricing wasn't announced and we also don't have a release date yet. But let's check out the phone itself. Move around. There's no buttons on the device except for the back. So right there you're just looking at the SIM card tray, I presume. Back there it's a 13 megapixel camera and you've got the unique volume controls and the power button in the middle so you can adjust those or launch the camera even from the back. Single LED flash. On top you've got the IR blaster. Nothing on the left or the right generally for buttons where you'd uh, see the volume control. Speakers on the bottom with a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. And here's the front where you've got the 5.2 inch full 1080p display. And it's an HD, uh, it's an IPS display as well. 3000 milliamp hour battery under the hood, and this is one of the first phones to launch. At least in the United States it will be with the Snapdragon 800 processor. That's a quad-core chip. Okay, let's take a quick look at the software here. It's running Android 4.2.2 Jelly Bean, so not the latest remote, or not the latest release, rather. They've got quick memo, cue slide, quick remote, sound, data, all the controls right here in the top. Miracast, battery saver, so tons of controls right on the top of the uh, display there in the notification menu pull it up we're not going to see any blowware here and we don't have a sim card in so it's uh can't tell which carrier this will be for but uh just based on this unit here let's see if we can find some music people are saying the audio is good well let's let's look at pictures first all right here's a sample video so you can check out the full hd display Pretty neat. It's a 13 megapixel camera with optical image stabilization, so they say that it should uh, prevent blurring, and a lot of the phones they're selling us have uh, either four or eight megapixel cameras with optical age image stabilization, rather. Let's see if we can check out some of the controls here. You can change the shutter, uh, the size of the photo you're shooting. It looks like it's set right now just 10 megapixels, so by default you'd have to switch to 13 megapixels. Geotag is off. You've got the capture key here. That's one of the options uh, from the back, so you can use the camera to capture a picture, or rather, the volume controls to capture a picture from the camera. FM radio we just saw there. So here's the Vienna's boy, the Vienna Boys Choir, rather. We just heard them perform. Now it's a little take, taking a little getting used to change the volume from the back, but it's a loud room. It's kind of hard to hear those speakers anyway. In any case, again, this is coming to AT&T, T-Mobile, Sprint, and Verizon Wireless in the United States in the coming weeks. This is Todd Hazleton with Techno Buffalo checking out the LG G2. What's up, everyone? John here. Thank you for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, I certainly hope you did. Click on the subscribe button right under me in my pants region to get tons more tech videos from Techno Buffalo. We've got awesome unboxings, comparisons, reviews, recaps, and everything else you can think of in the tech world right here on the channel. Join the herd today. If you want to check out some more content, just click right over this way to see some other recent videos. See you guys next time.